Hi everyone, this is Chris Terrell with Everyday VBA. In this video, we're going to be doing a Macro Monday challenge. The challenge is very simple. Um, hide the selected cells. So, we've selected some cells. All we're going to do is we're going to do the prompted. Do you want to hide rows? Do you want to hide the columns? Yes, yes. Now they're hidden. Now, I'm going to just go back here. Now you'll notice that that actually hid those. Um, so they're hidden right here, and they're hidden right there. I also, for extra credit, <laughs> like this is a like this is a test or a, or a class. Um, if you just go to your developer tab, I also wrote a macro for um, unhiding, which is actually the simplest part of this whole piece. But really, it's it's very simple. Um, you have to find out what the selected row is what the max row is um, and uh, my solution is with it includes an if statement and a loop um, there are probably other ways to do it but this is a fun one it's more of an advanced challenge but um, if you want to simplify the, simplify it just figure out how to delete some rows and delete some columns that's a really um, super handy actually um, you'll find that when you're doing macros a lot of times you can hide columns and hide rows just to make your data look cleaner um, and you can also that, that's something that you can record as well but if you want to get a little bit more fancy try the try the message boxes um, see if you can do that because in order to do that you do have to pass the response of the message box um, so this is a fun little challenge. This is this is a pretty pretty practical one too. And if you can understand, basically in Excel in VBA, if you can one do the work, um, two understand if statements, do statements, for statements, and kind of the syntax, you are well on your way to really becoming a VBA ninja. Now you do have to put in the work, but uh, it, it's definitely worth it. You can automate a lot of your a lot of your stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed.